My name is Gregory Kaidanov. Uh, I'm international chess grandmaster. I immigrated to Kentucky from Soviet Union in 1992. We immigrated uh, just uh, three days after Soviet Union officially collapsed. So this was a time when uh, the life became almost unbearable. There was hardly anything uh, for sale in the stores and uh, the country was disintegrating. My wife and I visited this place first in 1990. This was one of the stops um, on my chess circuit. And after having been robbed twice in New York City, we, we came to this place just for two days. And uh, I remember telling to my wife, it's just uh, heaven's front yard. That's how it looks. You know, people are extremely friendly. Nobody locks the cars and so different. Probably about 90% of my business is on the internet. So the modern technology allows you to speak either on the phone or on Skype, have chessboard on the computer screen, and uh, teach people almost the same way as you do life. It's a passion. It's, it's a passion border obsession. <laughs> I deal with people of so many different uh, ages, uh, ethnicity, and background. Uh, among my current students are uh, a nine-year-old uh, girl and uh, 72 year old psychiatrist. Log on ICC. I don't see you on ICC. I have time. Your choices are either, either going to H4 or taking the night. Those are your real choices. You see, and considering that you have this and this, this pen is really deadly for me. Yeah. All my students eventually become my personal friends. Uh, I, I would like to keep in touch with everyone. And again, internet is a blessing. You, you have two options. You have this move and you have this move. Which one is good? Uh, I like this one. Okay, that's exactly the wrong move. Thank you very much. Whenever somebody pins your knife, you automatically play this move. Sometimes I uh, complaining, uh, like, you know, I work six hours in a row today, I'm tired. So, and my son, he's 23 years old, he, he says, Dad, don't complain. When I tell my friends that you are making a living teaching a board game, everybody is laughing. How can you forget about your chess lesson, huh? Um, he, well, you, you used to be at like nine. When I go back to Russia, and I go every year because my parents still uh, live there. But every year uh, it becomes more and more like a tourist experience. Okay, country is changing rapidly. Uh, there are some things I like, there are some things I don't like. But there is no question that I'm a foreigner when I'm there. I speak their language as I know what's going on. But, you know, that's not my home. I don't miss anything. That's my home. That's my home. And, and, and I'm incredibly, incredibly happy to, to live here.